if you want to call up later, call up later. Uh, I really appreciate uh, your business. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much. Goodbye, Mr. Schumacher. Let our hosts know that we've arrived. Why don't we sit over here, my dad? We're going to have a meeting right now? Okay. Didn't take very long. I am not hostile toward you one little bit. Not at all. You think I'm playing not with you. Anybody. Think I think no, you think not I'm at playing all. with That's you. That's not at all. I don't yeah. think you're playing with me. And I'm not playing with you either. And in fact, whatsoever in that area. My understanding is that Mr. Kim's fascination with Svetlana is not sexual. You don't know this woman we're talking about. You don't know her. She's not some fucking bimbo. She's just not some fucking dumb broad that's going to jump at 150 clubs. Mr. Modest, though, I think I've acted like a gentleman. The fact that you people are three and a half months late on your note to me, I've never brought that up once. I don't plan to bring it up. No, you have a certain glint in your eye. I have no glint. I'd put a question to you, Ms. St. Tray. Have you ever met a man in any of your business dealings named Ben Malafidi? I... Is this a hard question for you? Well, I'm, I'm giving it serious consideration. You either know the guy or you don't know the guy. Ben Malafidi. What, what did you say the last name? He's a small time, two bit counterfeiter who has served in the federal penitentiary on a felony rap. Now, if the licensing commission were to come to the knowledge that a certain Malafidi, who has done time in the federal pen, is operating as your partner, a cabaret in this city. Let's cut the shit. I mean, you, would what, tend to are go you south. inferring that, that I happen to be this Ben Malafidi? Is that what you, this inference is? If this thing that I ask of you is not a thing that can be delivered, then certain other things are going to have to come to the attention of certain other people. So let me leave you to discuss your problems. Shall we go? It was awfully nice talking with you. I need a job, man. You had a job, but you couldn't get here when you were supposed to be here, man. I had to let you go. Yeah, well, listen, man, I had, look, got this, this friend of mine, he had a stroke. Don't you know what nobody, what a soul miss us, man. If we disappear, if, if if we were picked up by spaceships, wouldn't nobody know a fucking thing. about $150,000 for about, mm, maybe about a month of your life. Right. I am offering you a fucking opportunity. Don't pass it up. You don't know this woman we're talking about. You don't know her. She's not some fucking bimbo. She's just not some fucking dumb broad. Do you write notes sometimes? No. You just, just to communicate with your eyes. But you know, he, uh, He's got some. He's got some poetry he wants to give you. You know, I know. I guess he wants to take you and give it to you. That you read it. You know, just you and him be together. You know, and you go out somewhere. People don't touch you on this land very much, do they? Sometimes they don't get touched in the right place.